Hi guys, welcome to our Zen Den. My name is Valerie, thank you so much for watching. So, as you can see from the title of this video, I am gonna be trying out some goodies that I got from Red Apple Lipstick. They were so, so nice to reach out to me and send me these goodies. I have been following them since the beginning of my journey with makeup. I'm gonna be swatching lipsticks that they send me. If I didn't swatch a color that you want, please let me know and I'll try my best to get the color and maybe do a part two to this. If you guys are interested in that, just keep watching. All right, before I begin, I just wanted to ask you guys real, real quick to please give this a like and comment anything, a high pay, exclamation points, literally anything you want. That really helps with the algorithm of my little channel. And also, I am trying to reach a goal of a thousand subscribers by the end of this year. So if you guys are willing to subscribe, please do so. It would mean the world to me to reach my goal. I would feel so, so happy. So yeah, let's just get started with the swatches. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the things that I can't physically apply right now. And they actually were nice enough to send me these two brushes the first one here this is a bronze and blush brush it seems like such good quality and i love how soft the brush actually is and it's very poofy so i know i'm gonna love love using this and also i'm super excited because i use these all the time this is their professional lip brush these type of brushes i actually use them for eyeshadow i usually pack my shimmery shadows with this so i really like this brand because it is a very clean ingredient brand it says here it's gluten free lead and talc free paraben free and it's vegan so i I love love brands that have clean ingredients in them so that really attracted me to this brand okay so the next thing that I got that I can't try on right now I should have thought about this before but I completely forgot and it is their blush I got in the shade tango okay so I just fixed my lights a little because everything here was not true to color so hopefully that helps and hopefully it's not too dark like I was saying this is the tango blush it's like a very beautiful peachy color and I tried to pick the one that closest look to my skin tone I will definitely be trying this out on my next tutorial so be on the lookout for that if you want to see how this looks on me okay so I got four different lipsticks and a lip gloss here so I am just gonna be swatching them and showing you guys how they look Okay, so this is what their component looks like. I don't know if you guys can see it, but on the bottom it has like, I don't know what this is called. It's kind of like scaly, but it's very, very cool. It just adds something unique to this lipstick component. And on the top it has their logo, which is super, super cute. So this color in particular, it's Barcelona. And this is what she looks like. Very, very beautiful. So this is Barcelona and I had no idea how pigmented they are. I always thought that they were going to be more sheer but oh my god it literally just blew my mind and this color is so pretty and it looks really really pretty with the look that I created so by the way if you guys want me to recreate this let me know. This is a perfect like Valentine's Day look you know. I'm in love and it's only the first one though. I cannot wait to see the other ones. Let me know what you guys think and let me know which one is your favorite when I'm done with this video. Alright so the next shade that I'm going to try out is called gypsy soul and i immediately fell in love with it when first i saw the name i am all about that type of vibe so i also really really ended up liking the color this is a way more darker version than barcelona but that's what i liked about it it's a very night out type of lipstick if we're going anywhere which we're not but i love this color Oh my god, I really, really like this color. This is such a perfect vampy fall color. Oh my god. It's so, so beautiful. It's like a dark wine color. I love it so much. It totally fits with the name, which is Gypsy Soul. I love that name so much. All right, so the next color that I'm going to try out, it's called Beachside. And I chose this one because it's a very nude color and it's very, very pretty. I will usually typically use this with a lip liner, but for now, I'm just gonna put it all over my lips just because I'm swatching it. I am in love and so impressed with this one. This has been the butteriest color of all so far. And I was wrong when I said about the lip liner. Like for sure you could use a lip liner with this, but if you are my skin tone, you could just use it as is because this is so beautiful. It is like my perfect nude shade. I've never found a nude color that I can just apply and wear it on the fly because they've all been super, super light for me. But this one is 
perfect and I'm so happy I got this. I was almost about to choose another color, but definitely one of my favorite ones that I've tried so far. All right, so the last shade that I was able to pick up of the lipsticks, and this one is similar to Barcelona, but this one actually has tiny, tiny shimmers, so it might look a little bit different than Barcelona, but this one is called Strawberry Lips. Oh my god, I really like this shade. This is such a fun summer shade. It is the sheerest one I've tried so far, but it is perfect. It's very hydrating. It just feels so amazing, and I think the color is beautiful. It's just like a tint of color, so it makes your lips look natural, but it still gives it a little color. Okay, so the last item that I received is a lip gloss. This is what she looks like, and this one is actually called Tango Mint. And like it says there, it's a minty flavored lip gloss. So if you don't like that, then maybe don't try this. All right, so I went ahead and I applied a second layer just so you guys can see the true color. And oh my God, this is just like the last lipstick. This is so summery for me. It's very beautiful orangey coral shade and the mint sensation is not as bad as other lips lip glosses. I love this so much. I wish I would have picked out more lip gloss shades because this is amazing and it looks so fun and beautiful. And I feel like this color would look so pretty on any skin tone. So let me know what you guys think. All right, guys, this is it for this video. I hope you guys like this mini lip party swatch. <laughs> Let me know if you guys want me to do a part two. I can try to get different colors or colors that you guys want to see me use. Definitely let me know. I will be more than happy to do a swatch part two. Red Apple Lipstick, if you're watching this, thank you so, so much. I really, really appreciate it. And I was so happy when you guys reached out to me and I really appreciate it. Your products are amazing and I can't wait to see what you guys release next. If you guys like what you saw, please consider subscribing. Don't forget to like and leave me a comment. Anything will help with the algorithm. Rhythm. And like I said before, don't forget to subscribe. I am trying to reach my 1,000 subscribers that by the end of this year, so it would really, really help me if you guys would help me out with that. I hope you guys have an amazing day, and thank you so much for watching.